Hey guys. So today I wanted to try to make a video. Um, I've been doing dirty pours for a little while. I figured I might try to do a video on it. Um, I found this really, really cool paint. You can see it. It's called Dragonfly Glaze. Um, if you've ever heard of Chrome Illusion, it's kind of the same thing. So I figured that I would try it on a vase. Um, it comes out when you pour it, it's white. So I don't know which one of these is what. So I decided that I'm gonna add this. I don't know if you can see it, I'm sorry. It's all sideways. <laughs> it's all sideways. Okay, that's better. Um, I was gonna add that to a base. So that way I can kind of get a guesstimate on what I'm doing. Lord, I don't know what I'm ever doing. So here goes nothing. Um, I did, as far as my medium to thicken it or thin it up, I tried, oh my gosh, I do not have any room. Um, I'm using the full troll to help thin it a little bit because this, this, um, Dragonfly glaze is really, really thick. So you have to have to have something to thin it out a little bit. So let's get to it.
really, really marbleized. So, let's see. I can already see, uh, it might not show up on the camera, um, but there are tiny, tiny little flakes inside of it. So, let's just let it, let it sit and let it drip and we'll see it. And okay, guys, um, I really goofed up. I looked online because I was thinking to myself, glaze is a top coat. So this really, really, really could have went wrong had I not used the blue um, into the, the mix, into the pour. Um, it just probably would have looked like a white blob and you wouldn't have been able to see anything. But because I added that blue, see it has the, the purple when you shine the light to it. And I'm sure when it gets darker, it's a different color. Um, this is just because I have that my flashlight on my camera showing at it. And see, it's all kind of shiny and sparkly. It's really, really pretty. So yeah, I really used it for the wrong purpose. Um, next time I think I'm going to make something like this, something like this using those, um, color shift colors because they're really, really pretty. They're really metallic, um, without anything on it. And then, you know, if I don't like it or if I want to add something different, I'm going to try that dragon glaze on top of it just to kind of give it that extra step. I have one more, so I'm going to try it tomorrow if I'm not... If I'm not zonked but anyhow I do like this it you know it um, was a mistake but it's pretty I don't care you know it, this is you know purely a trial and error kind of hobby anyway so never the same I thought it was really cool look how pretty but anyhow yeah I like it even though I used it for the wrong reason. So if you're going to try to copy this, definitely paint your vase first before you use the dragonfly glaze because it will, it won't come out. It won't come out at all. It'll just look like a, look like a mess. So, okay. Bye.